Anita apologizes for assaulting foreign investor. Former Finance Minister Tendai Bite, who was convicted on Monday for verbally assaulting Russian investor Tatiana Elishina, has issued an apology. In his plea for leniency, Bite informed Harari magistrate Vongai Muchichuti that he did not intend to harm Elishina and expressed genuine remorse for the incident. His conviction stems from an incident at the Harari Magistrates Court in 2020 when he referred to Elishina as a stupid idiot. BT emphasized that the situation was exaggerated and assured that such behavior would not recur. His lawyer, Alec Muchidehoma, stated, the accused sincerely regrets the incident. Explaining that BT refrained from apologizing earlier to avoid interfering with ongoing legal proceedings. Muchidi Hama argued that Bita's remarks were provoked by Elishina's derogatory comments and asserted that Bita poses no threat to her. Furthermore, Bita highlighted his familial responsibilities, including supporting his children's education abroad, caring for his elderly mother, and assisting vulnerable individuals in his former constituency, Harare East. He also mentioned his legal practice and piggery business, which employ over 40 people and sustain his family. Bita underscored his mother's health conditions, emphasizing her need for constant medical attention. However, Tefra Kairambara, representing the state, urged the court to consider Bita's professional standing as a lawyer and his previous convictions. Kairambara emphasized the need for equitable treatment of the victim, emphasizing her age and gender. He argued that a financial penalty would not suffice as Bita is financially stable and suggested community service as a more appropriate punishment. Sentencing is scheduled for 3 p.m. Please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information or updates on news and entertainment.